Hey, good afternoon. I wanted to spend a couple minutes today um, talking about the concept of giving up your suffering. And what exactly does that mean? There are a lot of things that we do that we believe are uh, beneficial to us that actually cause us some form of pain and suffering, that take energy away from us that are not fulfilling. Um, we hold um, a set of practices or a set of behaviors or a set of circumstances that um, cause us a disruption in our life or an incongruency with our values and we hold on to them. So we think that things happen to us and that's true to some extent, that the world is out here and that things come in and happen to us, but there's also a component of us holding on to those slings and arrows in a way where we have some sense of pride or accomplishment in um, putting up with that level of suffering. So think for a minute about the things that you do on a daily basis that you take some pride in for uh, the level at which it doesn't feel good or isn't the best thing for you. So some, some uh, what's an example? Something about um, how many hours you worked this week without a break or how many hours you just worked today without taking lunch, or how you don't stop for work, don't stop at work to take a lunch break. Somewhere in our mind we take some pride, or we are disgruntled with having to do that on a regular basis. But still we keep doing it, we clutch onto it and hold it, because we're holding on to that suffering. And I would offer that there's an opportunity for you to give up some of that suffering. Maybe not all of it, but at least a piece. What are the things that you're doing in terms of working through the weekend or um, postponing some fun event, some uh, vacation or PTO day, or how about going into work sick um, in order to keep up with what you're trying to do and be, but continue to suffer along as you do it? And I would challenge you, is there, an, is there an opportunity to reduce that suffering, to let go of just a small piece of it, to give it up in order to have a higher quality life, in order to do better by yourself and those around you, in order to um, be less negative, to give up some of that negativity. We fall in love, we have some uh, attachment to that negativity, those, that suffering piece and there's an opportunity to be a better, more whole person by letting go of it. So take some time this week. Think about what it is that you suffer through and um, are willing to shoulder and carry on that um, doesn't necessarily benefit you in all circumstances. And look for opportunities to give up 10 or 15% just to start. Test drive what would be giving up this one thing for today. What if I took a lunch break? What if I went outside on a beautiful day and went for a walk instead of working through, straight through lunch break at work? I challenge you to take that opportunity for yourself and see what happens when we give up a piece of our suffering and what positive thing you can replace it with in your life. Feel free to comment in the comment sections below, send me an email, um, follow me on Facebook or LinkedIn, but I'm John Rhodes and I hope that you're able to find purpose and meaning in your day today.